so this weekend is what I like to call Black Independence Day. Uh, because it is Juneteenth. June 19th is this Saturday. Um, and for those who don't know, as Ashley mentioned, uh, Juneteenth is the day that the slaves were finally free in all of the Union. Uh, but that it, it was... Pause. When the slaves were told they, told were, they were free. free. Sorry. Exactly. They were already free. Right. Via the what? Emancipation, Emancipation Proclamation. Proclamation. January 1st, 1963. Texas, they want to tell the slaves. They right. So, so, yeah, actually, I'm glad you mentioned that. So, well, the news finally got to Galveston uh, on June 19, 1965. Uh, and read something today. They ain't even, they waited exactly one year to start celebrating. This wasn't a long, trying out, oh, let's make the thing in a couple years. No, the next, the next year they started celebrating, which is why I love our people. Uh, but the news finally got to Galveston, and then it even took a little bit longer for it to, you know, spread through the rest of the state. Um, apparently, you know, slave, some slave owners knew and were like, let's just uh, hold off on this information a little bit. Or some were like, let's just wait till the fall. So let's just wait till we get to the fall through there, get these crops harvested. That's already in the ground, so let's finish these and stuff like that. But yeah, June 19, 19 1865 was when the slaves in Texas were finally told that they were free. Um, and it is a day of black black blackness and i'm glad we're finally you know i said something earlier and i want to recant my statement i said it, i wish it was just a texas thing because growing up i thought only i thought everybody knew about it and some people outside of texas didn't but i'm glad it's grown into the to what it has now congress is uh passing bills to make juneteenth a federal holiday which just I, yesterday guys right just what? happened yesterday the senate passed the bill just yesterday to make it a federal holiday right and just it's going, going to, back the to the house right and then president biden's gonna well the house is gonna pass it obviously. I, I know and it's then president biden has to sign it. right i know it's not gonna happen because the people who don't look like me and you ashley will be up in arms about why do they get a day off and we don't because they just look for days to take off but if they want to make that a federal holiday and give black people the day off I'm down with that. So what do you you just you say you know it's not gonna happen? What they're I, giving black people the day off? Yeah, not giving giving black only black people the day off because people who aren't black are then gonna no. be like I should be able to have the day off too. Yada yada yada. That, you, you know, <laughs> you, you know that's gonna happen. Let me put it like this, Ashley. Well, that's obviously not gonna happen. Exactly. Everybody gonna get the day off if it's the day off. Well, <laughs> okay, you know what? Okay, fine, fine. Whatever. <laughs> Place it, only. I'm dead. Look, it's a black holiday. Okay. It is. They, they, the people who were holding us to slaves should not get the day off. They should have to work double. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, I'm so joking. if they have any slave owners in their lineage, is what you're saying? They yes. Have to work? And I'm still waiting on my reparations, by the way. Uh, uh, I, me too. <laughs> I'm still waiting on my reparations. Yes. I ain't got my 40 acres in the mule yet. Cancel so. my student loans. I will happily get hey, that as reparations. Let's go. I'm, da- I'm down with that. I'm down with that, Ashley. Thank too. you for the great idea. Uh, well, what do you plan to do to celebrate Juneteenth? It's on Saturday. Um, I will be, be in Houston with you. Ah, see. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, 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 Ashley. Ashley, you better be lucky. I love you. Because I was about to come. I was, I was about to say something that might have got me slapped the second you see me in Houston. Um, because it was going to be in relation to a mule um, and you. Um, we'll just leave it at that. Oh, okay, you were going to, yeah. No. I don't get it. But, you know. I, I was gonna say I'm hanging out with a mule, but you know, it's yeah. But you mean your belly? There it is. There she is. She hadn't been That's... here for a while. There she is. Uh, I but not. I am. No, I'm. I, I, my. Just I guess my Juneteenth plans are hanging out with my <laughs> best friend. <clears throat> uh, I guess we're going to the wedding. Um, but outside of that, just being as black as possible, because that's all yeah. I know how black to be. Black, 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 black. Yes, ma'am. Uh, mm-hmm. So yeah. Yes. Are they? Is there gonna be? I feel like Juneteenth and a wedding is a bad mix because you can't really say. I feel you like. Turn it up with other black people. Well, yeah, but I'm saying like Juneteenth. I'm thinking barbecue. And, mm, barbecue at a wedding doesn't really. I mean, if you're trying to barbecue earlier in the day, we can do that. Hey, you know what I'm saying? I got the, Juneteenth. I got the, really? the grill on my porch. What's up? Bet. You bring the meat. I'll bring, I'll bring the grill. What's up? Listen, normally Jim like Kelly got a pool. Let's take the grill to the pool. Hey, well, listen, they, what's they good? Got a grill over there. Listen, we can have a black celebration over there. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Right. But normally Juneteenth, whenever I celebrate Juneteenth, it is during the daytime. You know, yeah. like Juneteenth parades and stuff like that. It's, yeah. It normally is in the daytime. So the wedding ain't till night. Celebrations in the daytime and at night, we just keep the celebration.
celebrations going. You know, because yeah. it's going to be a whole bunch of black people dress they best, Sunday best. You, you know what I'm saying? Ain't black said excellent. Nothing for the word to me, Ashley. He <laughs> said nothing excellence. for the word. So that's how we're celebrating Juneteenth this year. <laughs> uh, yes. But yes, um, shout out to, first of all, shout out to those before us who had to endure that, uh, who had to endure slavery. Uh, but also, we are thankful that now we're being, uh, their accomplishments are one being celebrated. And two, the fact that we are, we have been freed is being celebrated as well. We're not 100% free yet. I, had, I got a shirt last year for Juneteenth that said free ish. 100% yeah. true because we ain't all the way yeah. there yet but we getting there we gonna sure. be there one day I mean we look at a mass incarceration how many of us blacks are in there right. for non-violent offenses you know ooh, you know what modern homework. day slavery homework for our non-black listeners watch <laughs> watch 13 on uh on Netflix that's your homework my non to my, and my black listeners watch 13 on uh Netflix that, that'll that'll learn you a little bit of something Yes, yes, it will. Or read the new Jim Crow. Yes. That's the book, guys. Yes. Read the new Jim Crow. Modern yes. day segregation. Yes. Mm. Yes. As you can tell, we are very black, pro black, black be black, black. And, you know, we're just trying to spread the blackness around here. You yes. know what I'm saying? You can be non black and still celebrate the blackness. You don't have to be black, but you make sure you celebrate out loud and in public. You feel me? Right. Don't celebrate behind closed doors. Right. Celebrate out loud and in public and let your black equality voice heard, okay? Be an ally. Yes. Out there, social media. Wear some shirts if you need to. Whatever you need to do, just don't do. Just don't do blackface. Please don't. Just don't, just don't do, blackface. do blackface. That's a don't yeah. do blackface. And That's I don't. An and I don't care. I don't care if it is in the little Wayne. If you are listening to Lil Wayne or Kendrick, just don't say the N word. Yeah. We're real. Last, I know we've talked about this, but look, guys, it, it's really not that hard. We just ask you not, not to say one word. And anything yeah. like it, any any other variations of derogatory terms, just don't say right. them, please. I get right. it. Look, the song's catchy. You might be bobbing along, but you know it's coming up. You've heard it ten times. You know when it's coming up. Just, and just please don't use mute yourself. Please don't use the excuse that your friend lets you say it. We don't care. I don't care because I'm not your friend. <laughs> I'm not your friend. I will hit you. <laughs> I'm not your friend. I will hit you. <laughs> I don't you. know about all that, but I will read no. you one no. something. I will. Okay. I'll, no, because and, and, I'm nice. I'm I'll nice. Roast you. I'm nice. If you say it, I'll let you know. Hey, please don't say that word around me. I'm asking you not to. And if you say, my friend, I understand that. I'm not your friend. Please don't say that around me. Once I've said that, I have made my position clear. Anything that happens after that is not my fault. That's all I'm saying. I I, I, I don't try to engage in physical violence, but if I need to to understand you, for you to understand my point, I will. I agree. I agree. But Mervin has much more patience than myself. Yes. I will roast I you. I do. And not think about it. And that not she here. will. That she will. 